आई एस अकेडमी फाइनेस्ट आई एस कोचिंग सेंटर्स इन दर्दर्न पार्ट ऑफ इंडिया एंड आई हैव प्रोमिस टू यू दैट आई विल डू यू नो मैक्रो एनालिसिस सिलेबस वाइज ऑन द हंड्रेड डे स्ट्रैटेजी माई नेम इज विवेक हरिनारायण आई एम एन आई एस ऑफिसर ऑफ दी तमिलनाडु कार्डर नाइनटीन एटी बैच इन माई लास्ट वीडियोज आई हैव टोल्ड यू अबाउट हाउ टू प्रिपेयर इन दोज हंड्रेड डेज और दोज थाउजेंड आवर्स नाउ आई विल गेट and tell you my strategy on how to crack that war which i said which is the preliminary examination in the next 100 days 1000 hours that is available to you so let's first take up a macro analysis of the preliminary examination paper that have taken place from 2013 to 2021 but trend analysis as you can see on my left hand side in the graphs which have come we still see that the big ticket is continues to be current affairs questions have ranged from anywhere between 15 to even as high as 27 questions out of the 100 questions that will come are based purely on current affairs and even the subject wise analysis if we do so whether you take up history or geography polity economy science and technology environment any one of them and as you can see all the questions even that they come on these subjects have some trend on current affairs so current affairs i think will continue to remain your big ticket for success you will have to study current affairs purely from a current affairs perspective as well as from all subject perspective uh in terms of subject analysis as you can again see from the graph history has been in 2021 a big ticket the number of questions have ranged almost about 20 questions from history geography continues to remain about 10 questions the next big ticket is polity as about 14 odd questions and uh, other subjects like environment is breathing importance uh, we will do another thara analysis of subject wise i am going to do a thara analysis of geography today but there will be a thara an analysis of all subjects including the big ticket especially environment i will now tell you what is the next important thing that you need to do so if you ask me one other thing which i had remember stress last time also was csat don't forget csat it's important remember you have to do the one paper on the, you know the prelim paper plus you have to do a csat questions total number of questions are 80 30 to 35 questions approximately about on you know aptitude and reasoning it's kind of split between reasoning and aptitude and basically on reading and comprehension these are the two splits of the 80 questions about 35 to 40 questions each it's important that you dedicate at least 8 to 10% of your time on this so i told you 100 days or 1000 hours so at least 8 to 10 days and anywhere between 80 to 100 hours please concentrate on your csat preparation to ensure that you know you will do really well but if you don't qualify the csat remember you will not be able to make it so focus on csat 2 now let's look at geography the reading material which you have to do is uh, basically the fundamentals of geography physical geography 11th standard ncert all the books are on my left hand side as you can see the entire chart has been put up but you are looking at fundamentals of human geography fundamentals of india and physical environment indian people and economy and we have given the time also you need to spend almost let's say about 8 to 9 days considering the size of number of questions that come in the preliminary you need to do about 9 days of study of geography the books are on the same basically fundamentals that's the fundamentals of physical and other uh, human geography from ncert levels these are the books that you need to study and focus on now within the analysis of geography we have seen in the last again from 2015 till 2021 a large number of questions have come on subjects like agricultural aspect of geography on climatology aspects of geography and uh, if you see there has been uh, questions on demography these are the aspects of geography which has come the detail analysis again is on my left hand side as you can see and what you need to do is that you need to understand that there are certain subject for instance tribes indigenous people only one question has been asked in 2019 now if you have to study geography for 9 days try and disaggregate your time again to study more on agriculture climatology oceanography there's a lot of things about physiogeography in fact in the year 2021 almost four to five questions were came out of the 11 questions five questions were only on physiogeography so 
subject wise analysis is also very important and I'm going to do it in geography. I'm asking other experts of Kingmakers Academy, which is one of the finest IS coaching centers in this part of the country in South India, to do it in each subject, book wise, subject wise analysis. I remember it's a strategy. I told you the strategy is that you need to go from point A to point B. The shortest distance is a straight line. In that time, if you have to do up and downs and you mix up timing, you will be missing the target. So the next one is your 100. I'll quickly now tell you as to what you should do and what you should not do. Among the do's before the exam, remain positive, very important. Remain healthy, which means avoid eating outside food because any time that you are unhealthy, you will miss out on those three, four days. It's a big time loss. Read and revise standard books, which we've already mentioned. Try and see that you do as many question banks of the previous years as possible. Practice more and more question papers. Attend rounds of various prelim rounds of test rounds that go on. Keep on doing that. And keep noting the mistakes that you do and try and rectify them. Identify your strong points and your weak points. Some of the things that you should not do. So obviously avoid all negativity. Anyone who's being negative, even if it's a close friend, stay away from them. Avoid all kind of junk food and other kinds of food which can tend to make you unhealthy and therefore take your time away. Please avoid reading unnecessarily new material at this point of time. You have to ensure that you just stay focused on the material that you have to do. As I said, you have to just score the number of marks which are necessary. Now, we have very clearly seen that uh, the analysis of marks of uh, the various years from uh, you know from 2015 the maximum marks that have been used in the general category is about 116 the minimum goes to a physical handicap category 3 which is about 40 marks you need to score if you're a physically handicapped person you need to score about 50 60 70 marks if you're a general category person you are looking at a cutoff of about 110 last three years the average has been 98 98 93.5 it's very low 110 is all you need to get. You have to strategize on just getting to ensure that you qualify and clear those things. So what are the things when you do when you sit inside the examination hall now? Before that, as I said, please look out where your center is. What is the travel time? If the travel time is one hour, give yourself at least another one hour for traffic congestions and things like that. Check up all your documents before you go and make sure that you have them correctly. Inside the hall, Attend your strong questions first. Go through the questions and attend your strong questions first. Remember, you need to get about 110 to 150 marks. That's all, which means you need to get about 56 questions right. For that, you need to do your strong questions. First round, do your strong questions. Feel good, about 40, 45 questions will be strong. After that, get into your very, you know, your less strong areas. Do about 85 to 87 questions in your very strong and strong areas. Revise them again and again. Please do not make the mistake of trying to do all 100 questions. Do not make calculated guesses in areas with which you are average. You will lose marks rather than gaining marks. Believe me, on the travel time, I have known of people who have missed the paper because they caught in a traffic jam. I have known of people who have missed this, the preliminary exam by 2-3 marks because they attempted in the last minute some 10-15 questions which they got wrong. Try totally avoid questions from bad areas. Do not make calculated guesses from average and bad areas. The best thing is to do a best calculated guess is from your strong and very strong areas. Remain positive and I'm sure you'll crack it. Kingmakers Academy will release more videos now on subject-wise analysis I've done on geography, it'll be on history and all other subjects it'll be done. Success is yours. Thumbs up.